Hi everyone, I'm Elijah. Welcome to Music Greatness. For today's lesson, I'm going to break down fantasy. It sounds just like this. Alright, for this first part, I'm going to break down the intro of the song. We're playing in the key of G. And for the chords, we're starting with E minor. Playing octave E on the left, with G, B and E right hand. So that's E minor, first inversion. Then we have B minor, octave B on the left, F sharp, B and D for the right, moving up to C major 7, and here I'm playing octave C with G, B and E for the right hand, going to G major 7, octave G on the left, F sharp, B, D, right hand. Then I'm going to play off key with this, A. So, octave A for the left, E, A, and C sharp right hand. So that's the second inversion of A major. And then I'm going to take everything up by one whole step to play B major. Octave B, F sharp, B, and D sharp on top. And then we have two chords remaining. The first one is E sus4 with E on the left, E, A, B and E again on the top for the right hand. And then we're going to resolve to E major, playing this. So for the left, I have E and G sharp and my right hand plays E, G sharp and B. Okay, that's for the chords. Here's the intro. Two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So I'm starting with E minor, moving to B minor. And before doing that, I have this played on my right hand, G and B. I'm going to play those two notes at the same time and then play E alone, like this. One and two and three. So on the third beat, I'm going to land on B minor. One and two and three and four and one. So on beat four, I'm going to play B and E at the same time. And on the end of the fourth beat, I'm going to play D alone. One and two and three and four and one. So now we're on C major seven. Four and one and two and three. And then same thing I did from E minor to B minor. I'm going to play G and B at the same time, followed by E. And then I have G major seven. One and two and three and four and one. Okay, after the G major, on beat four, I'm going to play C. And on the end of the fourth beat, I'm going to play B. So one and two and three and four and. Okay, from the top, 
two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Again, one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. Okay, let's continue. After that, we have a one, two. So I played A, A major, and then on the second beat, I'm going to play E with B. So one, two, and then I'm going to do the same thing pretty much, but once one whole step higher, like this, three, four. So on the third beat, I'm playing B, and on the next beat, on the fourth, I'm going to play F sharp with C sharp. So one, two, Three, four. One, two, three, four. And then I'm going to finish the first part of the intro with this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So on the first beat of the measure, I'm playing E sus four. One, two, three. And then on the third beat, on my right hand, I'm going to play E, G sharp, B. One, two, three, four. On the fourth beat, I'm going to sustain the E on my left, and I'm also going to add F sharp. And doing that, I'm playing E, F sharp, and B on my right hand. So that's E sus two. One, two, three, four, one. And then I'm going to resolve on the first beat of the next measure by playing G sharp on my left, still sustaining E, and going back to E, G sharp, and B on my right hand with a grace note from F sharp going up to G sharp like this. So one, two, three, four, one. One, two, three, Four. One, two, three, four. So as you can see on the second beat, I'm going to take down my left and play this low E. One, two, three, four. Like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And that's the first part of the intro. Here it is again, slow tempo. Two, three, four, and one. Two, and three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, so for the first part of the intro, we're playing at 80 BPM. For the second part of the intro, we're going to raise the tempo and play at 90 BPM. Playing this. Two, three, four E and one E and two E and three E and four E and one E and two E and three E and four. So the second part of this intro is very repetitive. We're going to repeat the same thing eight times over. This thing. So we're playing over E sus4. So E, A, B and E for the right hand. But now we're playing octave E down here with the left. And we're going to start playing it on the R of the fourth beat. Four E and the. Okay, so counting in sixteenth notes. One E and the, two E and the, three E and the, four E and the. Okay, so we have this. So I'm playing the full chord on the R of the fourth beat. Four E and the. And then I have this melody played on both hands. So that's D and then twice B 
followed by A, B, D, and then A and B. And now here's the rhythm. Like I said, we're going to play the full chord on the A uh of the fourth beat. And then we have D played on the E of the first beat and B on the end. And then we're going to replay the same B on the second beat. 3 E and 4 E and 1 E and 2. 4 E and 1 E and 2. Okay, then we have this going to start on the A uh of the second beat and then on the third beat we have B on the E of the third beat we're playing D and then on the A uh of the third we have A again and then on the fourth beat we're playing B so 4 E and 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and Again, 4 E and 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and. So that's what we're going to do. 4 E and 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and 1 E and 2 E and 3 E and 4 E and. Basically, we're going to play the same thing eight times over. Two, three, e and a four, e and a one. That's four. After that, we're starting the verse. Okay, let's recap. And that's all for this first part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.